Hi everyone, it's Kim and I am out in the woods today. I wanted to come out here and enjoy this beautiful weather. I promised myself that this spring I was going to come out more often and enjoy it. It's one of my favorite things to do so I can work while I'm out here and still have a good time and you know enjoy the, the beautiful blue skies and, and lovely weather. I don't know how this video is showing up. The sun is shining on my nose over here. <laughs> So I came out here, I thought it would be great to do a, a grounding type of energy. So we're going to be doing an ethereal crystal healing for grounding. Come back to this video anytime you're looking to do a little extra grounding. This will help you because this energy will be out there and you can tap into the energy so that you can ground yourself. We're going to be working on the earth star chakra. Um, we more commonly use the root chakra for grounding, which is great, but the earth star chakra actually can ground you um, much quicker and more easily to Mother Earth and so if you have all these like energies coming through you um, you know a lot of pulsing going on or twitching or excess energy you just kind of feel kind of out of whack um, sometimes it's really important you know to ground that energy put it into the earth and you always feel so much better so the crystal that I'm going to be using for this, and I'm not actually using the crystal, I'm using the energy in the ethereal, because the ethereal crystal energy is much stronger, more potent than what we find here on Earth. But um, I just brought it with me to show you. This is lodestone, also called magnetite, and it is magnetic. See, there's a paper clip stuck to it. It's magnetic. And so I thought it would be a really great one to work with with the Earth Star Chakra, which is located 6 to 12 inches below the ankles. So I'm going to go ahead and send you this crystal um, healing, and it's done, like I said, it's, it's ethereal crystal healing. I'll be sending the energy from the ethereal, so um, you might feel some, some warmth, you might feel like some pulsing or um, tingling sensations and that is the energy and this is going to help ground you and help you feel more connected to mother earth and and more grounded and stable so all you have to do is um, sit back you can lay down you can just sit in a chair however you're more comfortable um, close your eyes you know relax and I'm going to point the camera at a tree to help you focus in so you can imagine the, the roots of the tree really grounding, really being connected and part of Mother Earth rather than looking at me. So just take a few minutes to get yourself you know, in a state of, of relaxation so that you are ready to receive this energy. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and send this energy now. Now you can either just like look at the trees if you'd like or you can close your eyes, whichever feels more comfortable to you. And I'm gonna go ahead and send this energy. So that's it. I, I sent the energy. Um, as I started sending it, it got much more windy. I don't know if you noticed that. The wind really picked up, and um, I thought that was really cool because it only started just when I was sending the energy. 
Um, so I was really feeling connected, which I thought was really neat. And I hope that you enjoyed that. Please let me know in the comments below how you feel. Um, you can come back and watch this anytime. And, you know, also use your own intention. You can use other crystals. Hematite is great. Uh, black tourmaline, red jasper, pyrite, black obsidian. These are all wonderful crystals to use to help you with your grounding. Um, also, going out walking barefoot, of course, you know, in the dirt is, is, is always a wonderful thing. Or sitting on a tree or underneath a tree or walking on the beach barefoot. These are all wonderful ways for grounding. Um, just really getting out there and connecting with, with nature is, is really the way to do it. And, um, we're, you know, we wear rubber-soled shoes all the time. And um, we're not outside often enough. So, you know, we, we get very ungrounded. And so use this this video to help you ground but also use your own intention and your own crystal choices and, and get outside in nature yourself all right thank you so much for watching and as always guys have a blessed day